Hey guys, Iggy back again. Today I'm going to do an unboxing and a brief overview of the Asus Tough Z370 Plus gaming motherboard. This is based off of Intel's Z370 chipset. Now, this motherboard is going to be featured in the boss build video that I'm going to be doing coming up real soon. So come over here real quick as I'm doing the unboxing and I'm going to talk you through all the features and specifications of this motherboard. All right, so here she is again, the Asus Tough Z370 Plus gaming motherboard. So we can see the Tough Gaming logo right up here. Tough Gaming Z370 Plus. And then everything down here, Asus, Intel, uh, custom DTS, headphones, controller, AMD Crossfire, HDMI, VR Ready. And then along the side, just that that along the other side and then over here we have the UPC serial number model number all that good stuff and the -de 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 QR code top nothing much over there just some of the English auto tuning auto system level up other stuff <clears throat> we have the back of the box shows you the motherboard features and specifications over here and well all that good stuff, but let's get to the inside of this box. All right, so let's, I'm going to put the motherboard aside just for right now so that we can talk about everything in the box and then we'll get back to the board in a second. Okay, so well, here we have the IO shield. Nothing amazing here. Basic IO shield. All right. Then we have here some screws in the bag. These look to be like the M.2 screws for the uh, NVMe PCIe M.2. SSDs okay then certificate of reliability then they show you tough land guard capacitors chokes MOSFETs all that good stuff on here in case you want to see it a little bit closer all right the back is blank we have well, oh we have some more stuff back here okay I'll get to that in one sec. We have the Tough Z370 Plus Gaming Motherboard User's Guide and the Do, -do, -do, -do It Yourself Guide QR code. You know, good information here. A lot of people skip this, but this is going to tell you what the motherboard headers are, how to configure your front panel cables for your power button, LED lights, reset, and all that good stuff. So, definitely good information here. <clears throat> The Tough Z370 Plus Gaming Drivers and Software. Now, if you don't have internet access, which if you're watching this, you probably do, but if you don't have internet access, this is good to have. And also you need an optical drive. Um, I recommend when you get this, if you have internet access, just toss it back in the box. Just make sure there's no stickers and everything, but Toss it back in the box and go on Asus's website. Nothing else in there. Asus's website and download the latest and greatest drivers and BIOS. All right. And here, battery decals, some case badges. Yep. A few nice little case badges there. Pretty cool. And then time to gear up. Here's your coupon for 20% off Cable Mod Cables. Oh, that's pretty cool. My friends at Cable Mod include a little certificate here. Nice. <clears throat> All right. Then we have some SATA cables. Two SATA cables, it looks like. Yep. These are about maybe two feet long, but they have the little clips on both sides and one of them has the 90 degree angle. 
maybe for an optical or anything else, an SSD. And that's all the accessories that come in the box. Now for the part you all want to see, the motherboard itself. <clears throat> all right, she's a beautiful motherboard here. Z370 chipset covered back here in the heat sink. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six SATA ports down here. The front panel USB 3.0 header right here. Two USB ports, USB 2.0. And then over here is where you're gonna connect your, oh, this is, yep, where you're gonna connect your front panel, like button, power button, reset, LED lights, and front panel audio right here. And then right over here, actually this is front panel audio right down here. Back here that was, ah, for your speaker and other good stuff. So it's kind of long, longer than usual I would say. All right, and then we have, of course, one PCIe, two PCIe by 16s. This is electrically by 16. This is by, this is physically by 16, but I believe it throttles down to eight. And we have one, two, three, four PCIe by one slots. Okay, four dim slots, of course, for DDR4, up to 4,000 megahertz overclocked. And it does also support XMP 2.0. Uh, let's see, right. Actually, right under here, I'm trying to see how many. Right under here and right here are the two M.2 slots. You can see that right down here, the socket. And then right under here is the heat shield under there. Well, this is the heat shield. Take it off and then you have an M.2 socket right over here for your SSD. Nice addition. Okay, and of course, this is a socket 1151 motherboard. For example, for a Core i7 8700 or 8700K processor. In this particular build, I'm going to be using an 8700. My boss doesn't really overclock, so, and then I wanna give him a system that he doesn't have to worry about. It is Intel Optane memory ready. It does have USB 3.1 Gen 2, so you can see that right here and then an HDMI port right here USB 3 USB 3.1 this is USB 3C sorry and USB 2 it actually does have a PS2 slot uh, port uh, Ethernet right over here and then for audio okay this uses the Realtek ALC 887 a channel DTS custom audio. Okay, and there is actually another USB 3.0 front panel header right over here so that you can either have two or four, or if you only want two, maybe you wanna use it down here or you wanna use it over here, totally up to you. And of course, ATX, and it has one, two, three, four, five fan headers minus one for the CPU all right and then eight pin CPU power right up here and well that's about it for now um, right over here we can see the silk screening for tough Z370 plus gaming so again, that's about it for right now. This is just the unboxing and an overview. So you get an idea of what's inside the box. But uh, real soon, when I'm done with the build, uh, since he does want it real soon, I can't do an extremely intensive uh, tests, uh, benchmarks and all that good stuff, but I will do basic testing on it just to see how good it is and you know what it can do. Anyway, <clears throat> again, this is Iggy. Uh, doing an unboxing and an overview of the Asus Tough Z370 Plus gaming motherboard. Iggy out. See you guys.